Good Lord. They're gonna have to get bigger sticks to beat the frosting out of these fatties. <laughs> yeah, but they'll do it. Colonel Hill, it's an honor to finally meet our most decorated alumnus. You're darn skippy it is, but I don't want my boy getting no special handling. I assure you, Colonel, he'll get the standard treatment. <laughs> <laughs> Well, boy, may God bless you. Not that it would help you in here. I could hardly wait to see my grandson all toughened up. You think you folks could mail me copies of his daily beating logs? <laughs> Colonel Hill, you do realize things have changed since your time here. All right, you can email him to me. What's up? I suggest you get as much sleep as you can before the senior cadets come by to Welcome you. <laughs> oh no, I made code yellow. Oh god, my grandpa told me they'd come in and beat you with sacks full of frozen oranges. Let's go. Oh dang, someone's coming. Fly back and think of England. Hugh Grant, Spice Girls, Paddington. I don't get it. Why was that supposed to be scary? Well, five more minutes like that, and I guess it might have caused some hearing damage. My grandpa says that all you get for breakfast is a spoonful of salt and some stale bread. Oh, man. That's how they brainwash you. They starve you first. Okay, please move it. Crepe Station closes in five minutes. Uh, these sure are some good peas, Peggy. What's your secret? Microwave. I wonder if Bobby's being forced to sleep in mud or dung right now. Wait, what's today, Tuesday? Dung. <laughs> no one is answering, Hank. Oh, they're probably all bound and dead. Oh, my God. What if the wires from this doorbell are connected to his nipples? It is worse than I could have imagined. Will you let us in? Let us in! We demand to see Bobby Hill. Peggy, protocol. Sir, permission to see Cadet Hill while keeping a respectful distance from the grounds. Oh, you're his father. We talked on the phone. You're welcome to come in. I am? Of course. And so is your lawyer. We have nothing to hide. <laughs> Your concern for your son is perfectly normal, but I can assure you Cadet Hill is excelling here. Mom! Dad! Bobby! Honey, are you okay? Blink if you're not. I'm great, ma'am. Cadet Hill, why don't you take your parents to survival crafts class? I can attend a class at Fort Burke? <laughs> well, I won't let you down, Bobby. I mean, Cadet Hill. On the battlefield, you may find yourself stranded without enough water to survive. But with a sufficient quantity of mud, you will have the ability to create your own bowl, pot, urn, decanter, or beaker to collect rainwater. Very nice work, Mr. Hill. We'll make sure to have that glazed before you go. Did you hear that, Peggy? I'm doing it. I'm Fort Burke material.